Hello, I'm Pushkar and I'm master teacher in chemistry at Vedantu and I'm discussing the advanced 2021 solutions. Here's a question, very strange question in which a helium atom is colliding with a photon, totally absorbing the photon and the momentum of photon here is going to change the momentum of the helium atom. Assume momentum is conserved when photon is absorbed. So when momentum is conserved, we have to use the funder that the momentum of photon is given by h by lambda p is equals to h by lambda you are familiar with this one so the momentum of photon is given by h upon lambda and that must be equals to the momentum momentum of helium atom if we assume that helium atom was initially at rest from this we can calculate the velocity of the helium atom or the change in velocity of the helium atom so the simplest approach is that h by lambda is equals to mass of the helium atom into velocity so your answer will be v is equals to h upon lambda into m so now let us find out how to get this velocity calculation so calculation is p is equals to h by lambda that is equals to mv and v is equals to h upon lambda by m now h is 6.6 .6 in 10 plus 34 into 6 into 10 to the power 23 which is Avogadro's number which is given and 4 into 10 plus 3 is the mass of helium atom and 330 into 10 plus 9 is the lambda 330 nanometer we have converted the mass in kilogram first to calculate this velocity in SI unit so in SI unit we'll get the velocity 3 into 10 to the power minus 1 meters per second and when you convert it into centimeters it is going to be 30 centimeters per second so it's a simple question but as well as a complicated question because if you have done it in physics that's all right but if you have not done it normally in chemistry we do not see we do not do the problems of conservation of momentum so that is the difficulty level so i hope that you understand the solution and you uh, stay tuned for many such solutions thanks for watching